Our season one nostalgia tour continues with a look back at the car wash. You want me to do uh, the shampooing of the carpet? Oh, shoot. What is that? Little animal droppings. Where Kimberly stopped by for a hand wax, only to learn that her vehicle was the victim of a ferret infestation. Yep. <laughs> Did it. Yeah. A few hours later, Debbie pulled up, and unlike Kimberly's ferret-induced freakout, Debbie had channeled her fear into a phone conversation with her supportive husband. We're offering the service free because of the town ordinance, so you won't have to worry. So what are you doing? I'm gonna put the cage in the back here, just from where, just near where where they were, okay? And just honk the horn. Now? Yeah, honk the horn. Go ahead. Loud, loud horn. Loud horn. Well, yep. Loud and long. Yep. There we go. There we go. Oh my god. Yep. Oh my god, no. Yeah. No. We got them. They were in my car. Yeah. There's two. How do you know that that father is? That's a good point. You want to honk again? No. I want someone else to do it. You want someone else to honk? I'm freaking out. All right. Don't freak out. Don't freak no, out. Those were in my car. I know, but it's okay. We'll get them out for you. How did you get them in the police so fast? Here, I'll. It'll scare them if there's any more. Let me oh see my here. God. Okay. I think I'm gonna like I need a drink. Yeah, I know. So no. were there three? Oh my god, I'm yeah. taking a picture. Yeah, sure. Well, where did they come from? Like in my neighborhood? Yeah, it's all over the news. Oh my god, I can't believe it. Yeah. I am freaking out. Yeah, they get inside through and the so what do you do with them now? So someone comes and picks them up for us. Can you check like a hundred more times? Yeah, I'll check it, I'll check again. They're really cute, though. I mean, they're. But they're, are they rabid? No. Because they're they're wild, right? Yeah, they're they're, they're they're. They said there's nothing to worry about other than they scare people. So, yeah, we have a sign over here. See, right here on this pole. Come here. <laughs> yeah. I should actually go tell them to switch that to high. I'll be right back. You're the fourth one today. There's three ferrets in my car. At the house, I guess, or at work. You're gonna be fine. Open your back doors when you get out there and honk your horn and see if any come out. And run, because if you don't run. have a cage, yeah. Are you sure there's no more in there? Yeah, I'm gonna do another check for you. How did they even get into that trap? Well, the bottom is sprayed with a female pheromone. Uh -huh. Yeah, and I lift it a little bit open and then when you honk the horn, I made those ferrets appear because I'm a magician and you're on a hidden camera show right now. No. Yes. I'm Michael Carbonaro. No. Yes. Oh my God. <laughs> so just for kicks, we left the ferret threat level sign up there for the rest of the day. Remember people, if you see something, say something. 